안녕하세요. 제 이름은 나미입니다. Hi, it's Nami. Today I'm going to be showing you what I bought from Sephora. I usually don't shop because I already have a full professional makeup kit for my freelancing makeup artistry and I'm really thankful to be sent products here and there from companies. I usually just use my staple makeup products. I'm not like your typical beauty guru, influencer, PR package, newest makeup thing stuff. I actually was not expecting to make these purchases just because like every month there's so many products out there that are being released and so many new trends that are coming and going. I just stick to my basic makeup artistry products that I know and trust in. I'm not really into like reviewing new stuff because I just don't buy new stuff. <laughs> However, it was my birthday. I was like, oh yeah, my Sephora birthday gift. What should I choose? And while I was on the Sephora website, I'm sure this happens to the best of us, but I did end up purchasing a few products. The total turned out to be close to $200, approximately around there. Ta-da! Oh my gosh, I'm actually so excited. Ah! When I saw these eyeshadows on the website, I was like, oh my gosh. Sparkles, I cannot resist. <laughs> this is the Huda Beauty New Nude Palette. I'm not sure how old this palette is. I did see it floating around for a few months on my YouTube recommended. I'm actually very excited to try this palette because, oh my gosh, the mirror is huge. Wow, <gasps> I'm impressed already. <laughs> there is apparently some tea with this palette and just Huda Beauty in general, of course there's always gonna be criticism. There's always gonna be drama and gossip, but I don't know any of it, so. Oh my gosh, I can't. I can't even look at this. Guys, this is the reason why I needed to get this palette. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Oh, wow. Oh, I'm just gonna swatch this sparkly ones because. They're the reasons why I bought this palette. <laughs> I like how there's a lot of matte shades because you can always add shimmer and glitter on top of matte, but you can't take away from an eyeshadow to achieve a matte look. So I like how all of these are matte that are not the glitter shimmer shades. Ooh, it's so creamy. <gasps> oh my gosh. This is no joke. Look how pretty it is. Wow. Oh, it's so beautiful. I'm like in awe right now. There's like speckles of iridescence, almost pink and yellow on a peachy base for the shade Crave. Wow, when I just like tap, ooh, ooh. I feel outdated. I feel like a caveman, oh my gosh. Wow, this one might be my favorite. Ooh yeah, that's my favorite. What do I do with my life? Man. I am so uncultured, so behind. I'm really glad that I bought this palette. I know that this, oh my gosh. It feels like silk. Oh, I can't even look at it. Oh my gosh. It feels like buttery velvet. Like it literally feels like you're touching velvet. What did they formulate this with? It feels like butter. Yo, okay, so these three are glitters. They're just pressed glitters, but they, I don't understand. How did they get this texture on a glitter? Wow, I got this Sephora Beauty Insider Long Wear High Pigment Kat Von D Beauty Sample Set. It has the Tattoo Eyeliner, which I have never tried before, but I've heard like a lot of good things about it. The Locking Setting Powder it has and Studded Kiss Lipstick Samples. Made with love, not animals. These are the lipsticks. There's three shades in here. Outlaw, Lolita, and Vampira. They're cute. And then there is the setting powder in Translucent, the Locket setting powder. It's kind of miniature. It's so cute, it's so small. And a mini size of the tattoo eyeliner. It's a brush tip, so it's not felt tip. There's actual bristles, and the ink runs down these bristles. I drew a heart for you. Heart. Oh. 
Oh my gosh. Okay, so I saw this from Fenty Beauty because it was like in the scroll at the bottom. You know those like cursed scroll bottom things that just show you more products that you want. It's so glittery. Look how much glitter is on the packaging, just the packaging. Wow. This is the Fenty Beauty by Rihanna Diamond Bomb All Over Diamond Veil. How many carats it says? That's, I think that's the name of the shade. Super fine 3D sparkle for face and body. Insane diamond dusted effect. I'm actually so excited. Oh my gosh, but there's glitter everywhere. Yo, this is my first Fenty product. I'm so behind. Like I'm telling you, I'm just, I'm, I'm a cave woman. I'm uncultured and I just live in my house. <laughs> that's basically my life. I heard really great things about her beauty brand. And yo, this packaging, this is some sturdy stuff. Like, this is expensive. <laughs> Guys, the beauty world has improved since I've been gone. I haven't looked at products for like a good five years. Honestly, I used to go every week to the beauty boutique, spend 45 minutes every day, every time I'm there, just looking at every single product that's out. Oh, it's so soft. Oh, it's so soft. Oh, it's it's pretty. It's just like a, it's a diamond veil. It, it glitters and it shines and it's supposed to be like a, a veil of glitter. I did read some reviews saying people saying they didn't like it because the glitter ends up everywhere, but I'm sure if you use a setting powder, it'll be fine. The product description does say that it doesn't move too much, but I mean with glitter, it just ends up everywhere anyway. Why <gasps> Buddha? It's so soft. I'm very impressed. It doesn't feel like chunky at all. It's very soft. And then the last product in my box is also from Fenty Beauty. It's one of their highlighters. This one is in Kilowatt. Freestyle Highlighter Duo. Creamy, long-lasting, endless ways to glow. There's Girl Next Door and Chic Freak shades. Ooh, classic. Wow, wow. It's not just white plastic, it has iridescence on it as well. Shines iridescently. It's so pretty. Ta da! The reason why I got like pinkish highlighters is because I wanted to use it double as a blushing highlight as well. It's so pretty. I really like it. I'm satisfied. I don't regret these purchases at all. I'm very, very satisfied. Oh my gosh, do you see this? It's been a while since my last like makeup haul video or like just makeup in general which is kind of sad because uh, this is my profession <laughs> but uh, these new products, they, I just don't keep up with them because there's too many but please let me know what you think do you have these products as well? have you tried them? do you like them? do you want to try them? this was a pretty like chillax video but if you liked it, please Definitely give it a thumbs up so that we can see and if you didn't like it, you can give us a thumbs down. If you'd like to see more videos like this, definitely make sure to ouch my thigh. Subscribe and hit that bell notification to be notified right when new videos drop. That's usually the time that we do take to reply to your comments. I also post every day on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and Snapchat so I can check you out on these platforms if these are platforms that you use. That's it. I'll see you next time. Bye!